So how do they truly feel about you right now? Be in the present. Be in the present time and dream of the future. When we dream, everything is possible. And this has come out with like attracts like. If you are longing for more love in your life, you need to be more loving. Wow, so they are learning to be in the present moment. I feel there's a strong emphasis in your connection. Like there's just an intuitive understanding within your person to um, really be in the now, really focus on so much positivity so much abundance within this connection you know like they say in the law of track the law of attraction to have that attitude of gratitude it's it's that basically really they're really bathing in the absolute beauty of your bond the intimacy of your souls but they are dreaming of the future as well like they want so much more to unfold between you both this is powerful manifestations coming in with this castle here you and your person you are deeply connected in the higher dimensions the heavenly realms and you and your person are going inwards this person is going inwards so much to connect with you in their heart in their mind in their soul telepathically because this is the real you um the soul the infinite soul this is a temporary human experience a false matrix a lot of illusions a lot of limited perceptions in this world you are both really connecting on those truer levels deeper levels and they are absolutely ecstatic about how this enables you both to experience true intimacy your hearts truly opening to each other experiencing the magic of the infinite of true love they really really love that they have met you they've met their match like attracts like you're like a mirror image of each other in many many ways your frequency is a direct um connect a direct match so they're daydreaming about you thinking about you constantly longing for you feeling incredibly special this connection is special they feel very special like you see how incredible they are like you really really love their soul um their feet i'm seeing i'm feeling a lot of light and warmth um in awe yeah, look, true love, your person and yourself is basking in this. How your person is feeling is also very much about how you are feeling. You're so deeply connected with each other that the energies continue to circulate between you both. And I feel like there's a lot of daydreaming, a lot of magical energy right now, euphoric excitement, knowing that you know you're both living in the present soaking in how amazing this is this is a once in a lifetime love look at all of these this magic with this magic wand but it looks like fireworks as well and music and harmony and bliss passion closeness connecting with your soul family embracing each other on the deepest soul levels to me this image here is also you both learning to love your inner child so they're in the present moment experiencing all of this bathing in this you both are and i feel like this is intensifying right now or is about to intensify the bliss and deep intimacy between you both um but it's also them knowing that so much more is going to unfold between you i mean you have an infinite bond so there's an infinite amount of time even though time doesn't really exist other than in this false matrix but nonetheless there's an infinite amount of time to explore each other explore this connection explore yourselves and your bond with the divine true love like attracts like you are want both desiring true love like your person is just 
overflowing with joy, thinking about all of this, the synchronicities that led you together. There's many, many amazing synchronicities and deep meanings behind a lot of things. The parallel paths that led you into oneness. They, they love thinking about the similarities, you know, that, that there doesn't need to be this pressure of you both being exactly the same, but there's a lot of similarities, many that you feel deeply, intuitively. How else are they feeling? Wow, the union of hearts. There is a connection of love that defies explanation. So they want to kiss you, okay? There's two cards here about you both kissing, embracing. This is what they're imagining, okay? Because this is them looking at the stars. They see you in nature, everywhere they're going. They're looking at the sky. Um, during the day, at night time, looking at the stars, feeling the wind on their skin, um, seeing you in the ocean, in nature, wherever they may be, whatever they are doing, they're feeling this absolute bliss. And you are too. There's a lot of this partnership energy, um, that infinite bond, the energy circulating. They're totally in love like you are and it's very peaceful like it's so healing because there's this sense where you can just be in this energy you can just be yourselves you're totally accepted there's a non-judgment here there's complete acceptance and cherishing each other nurturing each other into feeling safe and secure to blossom into your true selves. This person feels very lucky. You both feel extremely lucky. You see each other as very highly, highly valuable, very mature. You're both very old souls. So how else are they feeling right now? Family, soul family. Look, there's so much comfort here. This is a safe sanctuary. The divine has placed you both together as these twin flames in the divine womb. This is where you're both growing into your true soul selves, tr growing into the highest version of yourselves, into much more confidence, healing. It says belonging. It's this deep sense of belonging, community, because you're so connected with the soul family, like they're very aware of this. Um, soul tribe and just warmth, warm fuzzy feelings and they love just feeling completely connected with you, completely close and look two, which is partnership they're just so happy, you both are, it's very much mirrored energy, like attracts like, mirrored energy how else are they feeling today? sound and we already had one of these other cards yeah with music so harmony feeling the vibration it says 33 here as well and this is 30 so threes could be appearing to you in number patterns it says music silence they're feeling the silence which means the truth beyond all the noise in this false matrix, beyond all the noise in the conditioned, overactive mind that we're all conditioned into, you know. Everything, you know, like mobile phones and um, even I've noticed over the past 20 years, cartoons for children and things like shorts or uh, TikTok, everything's uh, rapid fire, shorts, you know, designed to shorten our attention span, um, but also make us addicted to always looking to the next thing. It's a distraction for, for the mind. It's to occupy the mind to distract us from the silence that is behind all things. Love, truth, oneness with all things. God, you and your person, you've broken through the barriers of this false matrix and are very much within the divine the fifth dimension new earth higher dimensions while still being in human form and this is where all of this bliss is coming th from as well 
being in the heavenly realms whilst on earth. Rhythm and vibration. There's a natural flow, natural rhythm between you, creating this symphony. This is that divine masculine and feminine working very well together as a team. You appear to be a duality, but that's only because you're in this false matrix, which is all about the idea of duality and separation. Together, like that yin and yang, you are one in truth. So they're, they're feeling all of this. They know this, you know, on levels beyond comprehension. But I also feel this person does consciously know a lot about your connection like they have a deep profound conscious understanding as well what else are they thinking about communication they're thinking about opening up to you so self-expression exchange sharing and connection so they're thinking of communicating to you that they know you're the one that they know this is true love opening their heart to show you love so for some of you, you could be hearing from this person very soon, or this is just a confirmation because for some of you, this person is already communicating their love to you in several ways, perhaps, um, especially through the heart, through the energies, telepathy, but it could also be in the 3D in certain ways as well. So you could hear from this person with communication and the sound card as well. Wow. This is like the Holy Grail. It says emotional balance. You really help each other to come into balance. It's a firm foundation where you feel safe and secure to be able to let go of distractions primarily letting go of anxiety which is another distraction fear anxiety it's all designed to um, distract us from going deeply inwards and feeling safe and secure to really grow into who we really are and that is what's happening with you growing into yourselves opening your hearts self-love communicating love to each other the heart is the portal to the true self and the infinite. It says stability, harmony again, peace, fluidity. Such a powerful psychic bond here. But it, it, it also feels very stable with them being trees here. The roots are stable. It's an unbreakable bond. It could be manifesting more in the 3D for some of you as well. Wow. So much loving, happy, peaceful emotions your person is experiencing right now. How else are they feeling? Inner peace. We just had this peace. In their heart, they feel peace with you because they've met um, their soulmate. They feel this deep sense of belonging, soul family, knowing who they are, helping the collective. They could feel surrounded by a soul tribe. They feel in a peace. You are enough. I am enough. They're doing some sort of spiritual practice or some sort of work on their self-esteem and loving themselves. And it's really paying off. Whenever I see this, it's like they could be at work during lunchtime. They have a lot more time to think about you, even though they may still be very busy during their lunchtime with this book and the pen here. But nonetheless, they're, they're daydreaming perhaps a little bit more. inner peace this is just how you feel with each other the resonance the heavenly realms that you experience in this true love how else are they feeling today manifestation yeah grounding like i said and look the infinity symbol this is like you and your person but this is the heart's healing 
your self-esteem. There's a lot of sexual energy, creative energy. Your person is expressing, communicating, being creative um, about putting their light into this world as well. This is very much a part of your connection, the sole mission to help the collective. And they're very enthusiastic. Um, it's like you are each other's muse. And you're both being so benevolent, so loving, so kind and generous with others because your cup is full. You're both more energized to give more. I feel like you've also been learning healthy boundaries. And that is a lot to do with giving to yourselves, filling your own cup. But now with the amazing love you both share as well and how you feel so supported by each other and the divine, your cup is full and overflowing. And again, it's self-esteem with the two sunflowers here you are the light in each other's lives you're both growing tall the sunflower you know turning towards the sun this is you both turning towards the great central sun you know basically ascending back to to god or the divine or source whatever you want to call it so they are actively taking time to be in stillness a meditative state imagination in order to manifest so much positivity and intimacy oneness between you both and peace within themselves spiritual healing yeah to confirm worthiness has come out this mirrored energy loving yourselves this is completely transforming you it's opening your hearts to, for you both to be able to receive love and feel um, secure to communicate your true feelings as well. Worthiness. They feel that they're manifesting worthiness, inner peace, to have this courage to, to open up and come forward and express themselves more to you and just in general express their true self, their light in this world. And they're so happy about this. The gardener. Wow. This is what is so incredibly attractive about this person. They're very hard working. They intuitively know how to be so nurturing and tend to the garden of this connection of themselves as well. Like they see you everywhere. The divine feminine is in the bushes, the trees, the flowers, the plants. And they're growing more of this. They want more of you in their life. They love your divine feminine energy. They're thinking about you constantly. They're really, really mature soul. Really, really nurturing this bond. And this is also what's making the divine feminine's cup full and overflowing. And helping you be in so much positive blissful energy that this is radiating from you. And it's going to them and vice versa. So they're absolutely over the moon, okay? They're so incredibly happy. If this reading has resonated with you, please let me know in the comments. Give it a thumbs up, share it, subscribe. That all really helps me out with the algorithm. Thank you so much for joining me here. Take care. Bye.